Hello, today I'm back and I'm going to do a reveal. And here it is. <laughs> it is a travel bag. It's made by Samantha Brown. And she, I don't know if she was a blogger, but I knew she had a travel show a few years ago where she traveled to different cities. I think it was called $40 a day. Um, where she went to different cities and, you know, a travel saw different parts of the cities um, for that amount of money. And then she went on just to do regular travel where she went to different cities. But she has a line on HSN. And it's usually the luggage that she had. Um, I didn't need any luggage but I did want to try her line. The pieces that she had looked very interesting. She had accessories and before everybody got on the bandwagon about the the travel cubes, she was the first one that I saw a long time ago with the travel cubes. So she expanded on that um, into different travel accessories. But this is the one I chose. It's a travel bag, uh, a bag that you can carry into I guess the plane or bus train it's a good overnight bag and something that you can use like I said if you just have that one bag you want to take on the plane with you or maybe it's an overnight trip something you can carry in your vehicle but I'm gonna break it down for you it's a good size i'll put the measurements in the description or on the screen it has two handles here at the top but it also has this strap and it expands out you can actually wear it cross body if you need to and on the strap, it's embossed with uh, travel, adventure, explore. The hardware, I don't know what this material is called. It's not, well, that might be metal, just covered. Yeah, feels like metal. But it's the same color as the zipper. It also can convert into a backpack. And you take these off. And you hook them. Hook them. <laughs> right there at the bottom on both sides now if you choose not to use it as a backpack this is a pocket back here and it's zipped at the bottom so you can leave it zipped and still put extra items on the inside if you like or you can unzip it And slide it on to your suitcase. It also has a pocket back here. Just in case you want to put things a little bit closer to your body. It has two pockets on both sides that you can use for water or an umbrella. It has this pocket right here in the front. And it has two slide pockets right there in the front. And 
And then another zip pocket across the top. Now this one isn't as deep, so you can keep items that you need really quickly, maybe your cell phone, passport, IDs, um, travel, paperwork that you may need quickly. And now we're going to go to the inside. Now on the inside, on this side where the backpack straps are, you have this long slide pocket. You could probably put an iPad in there, a book, notebook, any items that you want to hold securely inside the bag. And you see it has that Velcro. On the outside of that, it has two slide pockets. Now this material, it looks like leather, but I'm pretty sure it's not leather. It also has a water, bo water bottle holder, but you don't have to put water there. You can put other items there. If I flip it around on this other side, You have another zippered pocket, but this one has the, I guess, the webbing for items. Maybe you uh, have something that needs to dry or just some items you want to see, but you don't want completely out of sight. It's pretty deep. But it can hold an outfit for overnight you could use it for work as well I'm pretty sure a laptop will fit in here as well as paperwork files your lunch it's a good convenient travel bag so now I'm going to put a few items in so you can see or just basic basically get an idea of the capacity of this bag so hold on one second. And there was also another item that I purchased from Samantha Brown. And this is her toiletry travel bag. That, it didn't come with the travel bag, but it was matching. She had other accessories that matched. But this is the one that I liked and really caught my eye. It's a round toiletry bag. And when you open it up, it has little sections on the inside. It also has a little mesh netted zipper compartment at the top. And the way they showcased this item was I believe she said that her makeup artist used it to hold a lot of her makeup and accessories it can also be used like a tech bag where you can keep your cords up here and separate other items down here at the bottom um, it can just be used as a regular toiletry bag where you keep your uh, travel Travel needs in here, your toothpaste, deodorant, travel, um, makeup brushes. And just close it up. And zip it back up. It matches the bag. And it caught my attention. I thought it was really cute. And it just has her initials down there at the bottom but I'm going to put this in the bag as well so you can see how it fits in okay so now the bag is packed there's still space in it but I put enough in it so you can get an idea of what it can carry and you know make adjustments for yourself or make a decision for yourself
Now on the side, I put in an umbrella. And then I'm gonna go on the inside. And you can see that I put the accessories slash toiletry bag on top. I also put in my iPad on the side pocket. And it's inside of here. I put the water bottle on the inside. And I also packed an outfit. Well, two outfits. A pair of pants that I rolled up. A top to go with it. A dress that I rolled up. And at the bottom, a pair of shoes. And these just a pair of loafers. And that's it. And there was still space for other items. But this can be used, like I said, as a travel bag. You could use it as a gym bag. You know, just in a nice travel bag. I wanted this because last year I bought a new suitcase when I went on my cruise. And I purchased a backpack. Some people were recommending a backpack, which was fine. The one I chose, I liked because it had the insert for, if you wanted to charge something, you could put your portable battery inside of it. But all the pockets, that your normal backpack has. It wasn't working for me. It was a nice backpack, but I ended up giving it to one of my nephews. So when I saw this on HSN one night, it was one of their daily specials. I decided to go ahead and try it out. I thought this one was more of what I needed as far as the zippers and the compartments. I felt like I could get get to things a lot easier and I plan on using it when I do some more traveling this year not that I'm doing a ton of traveling but I just want things to be convenient I know that it's very pricey or getting very pricey um, when you bring a lot of um, suitcases or you know bags with you they're they're charging you for everything um, so I just wanted something that I can use that could hold, you know, necessary items for me. Um, and I could use during the entire trip. I think it's really cute. I like the way it looks. And I'm going to show you how it looks on my suitcase as well. So here is how the bag looks on the back of my larger suitcase, which I like. And I just want to preface this with, they did have different colors, but they were selling out really quickly. They had a blue, a magenta, um, a multicolor, and this one. And they also had the matching toiletry bags, but they were selling out quickly as well. And this is a larger suitcase. So it fits all the way up to the top. This is a, a Samsonite. So let's see how that might work for you. And that's how it looks. From the other side and here it is 
on a smaller suitcase. So it fits on both bags easily. And I think you would really like it. It's a very convenient bag to have. And like I said, Samantha Brown, I don't know that she's in regular stores, but she is on HSN and she usually comes out with something every couple of months or at least once a year. She's really big on the packing cubes and just packing smarter, uh, rolling up your items and a lot of her products have ways for you to put your, your items in quickly, easily. She's been all over the world, so she also gives different tips on traveling worldwide or locally. But I'm going to try this bag out this year. It was only, I want to say, like $45. I don't think that's bad, especially if it gives you all the, the pockets, convenience that you need. So once I'm able to use it a few times, um, hopefully I'll be able to take a couple of trips um, this year. That's the plan and just get out and travel. Um, I know the pandemic held a lot of us back, but now that things are pretty much opened up, get you some nice luggage. I wanted nice luggage um, for convenience. You know, this bag on the bottom was a bag that I had. It's still holding up, but it's a smaller bag and I needed a bigger one. But, you know, get something, you know, you can afford, don't, don't break the budget for it, but get you something nice that you can travel with that's going to protect your items. And I, I think between this bag and the Samsonite that um, I'll be able to do a lot of things, go a lot of places and feel safe and feel like my stuff is protected. Um, so that's it. If you have any questions, please let me know. And um, I'll see you on the next video. Thanks.